For the news tonight, celebrating life in the bond of sisterhood. Good evening, everyone. I'm Sean Hegarty. The BGSU community said goodbye to three sorority sisters killed in a wrong way accident two weeks ago. Fox Toledo Sharia Davis is live with reaction from family members who attended tonight's memorial. <laughs> The girls of Alpha Z Delta held a celebration memorial outside University Hall. Hundreds of people honored the three girls who lost their lives from that tragic accident, but they also wanted to let the family know the girls will never be forgotten. Tears of sorrow filled BGSU's campus this evening during the celebration of sisterhood. There's going to be a lot of celebrating of, of who they were and, and what they have left behind. Guests signed three memorial cards filled with messages as they remembered Rebecca Blackholt, Christina Goyed, and Sarah Hammond. The three were killed after a wrong way driver hit their vehicle on I-75. That driver also died. Angelica Moormill and Kayla Samolis were also injured. They were heading to Detroit Metro en route to spring break. The victim's family shared wonderful memories while stressing never take life for granted. Sarah, Christina, and Rebecca, they're gone, but we will remember them forever. And I will know I will see my pretty girl again one day in heaven. Live, laugh, love was one of Christina's favorite sayings, and it was Christina. She knew how to live life to the fullest, laugh so hard the tears would fall, and love with no bounds. She would want us to go out and live, laugh, and love. The ceremony concluded with a walk to the Alpha Z Delta house. There the sorority sisters released balloons with messages attached in honor of the three and wish more Mel and Somalis a speedy recovery. It's going to be it's going to be a difficult, you know, journey, but there are no two better women to make that journey because they're so strong. Mormel and Somalis' family released a statement. They are both out of the hospital. Kayla was transferred to a rehab facility in Sylvania. Angelica was transferred back to the Cleveland area for medical care. During the ceremony, the university announced a sorority scholarship created to honor the lives of the three victims. Reporting live, Sharia Davis, Fox Toledo News. Sharia, thank you very much.